Bill Gates and Charlie Rose are both celebrities in different respects. It is this celebrity status that allows them to overcome certain distractions while they speak. By observing their challenges, we develop opportunities for improvement. What is your belief and your goal? What do you believe is possible for Microsoft to do in search? Conversationalizing is moving your hands or your head in the rhythm of your speech. Notice how Charlie Rose moves his hand and head on key words. Believe. Possible. Microsoft. To do. Search. Whereas the voice can place emphasis on many words, the body cannot do the same or it becomes a distraction. Let's play it in real time. What do you believe is possible for Microsoft to do in search? What do you believe is possible for Microsoft to do in search? Conversationalizing is also apparent in the movements that Bill Gates uses as he tries to emphasize key points. Other browsing type behavior in ways that, that could work well for everyone. Other At times, gestures may even move that, that on every well syllable. Other browsing behavior in ways could work well for everyone. Let's play it in real time. Other browsing type behavior in ways that, that could work well for everyone. Although the repetitive movements of conversationalizing can be distracting, gestures can be used effectively to explain concepts or relationships. Virtual space is used by the body to link referenced items in the voice. The challenge is to use different virtual space to identify different concepts. Their advantage in software, their advantage in time, and how they've used their resources. Their advantage the hand software, tries to establish in emphasis and how in space. Their resources. Charlie Rose is using the same virtual space for three different words. Software, time, resources. Once virtual space is used to establish a particular reference software, the same space cannot be used time. to establish additional references. Resources. Even Bill Gates makes multiple references using one virtual space. It does require incredible scale, dedication, long term, because the technology is very, very deep. Incredible scale, dedication, long term, because the technology is very, very deep. However, when a different reference occupies a different virtual space, the communication is easier. Here, Bill Gates describes different periods of time using different virtual space for each period. Well, I think search today, compared to what it can be, is absolutely terrible. Compared to what it was, say, uh, two or three years ago, it's, it's fantastic. Notice how he well, identifies today, today to what, what can be, is absolutely terrible. Compared and to what, what was, was say, uh, two or three years ago, it's, it's fantastic. And although Bill Gates takes advantage of virtual space by separating items in the air, he inadvertently stumbles upon yet another challenge. It has to do with timelines. Well, I think search today, compared to what it can be, is absolutely terrible. Compared to what it was, say, uh, two or three years ago... Using a personal time timeline, he establishes the present, but his right hand shows the future, terrible. his left compared hand, was, the past. Say, uh, two or three years ago, it's, it's fantastic. Because the audience sees a similar timeline, past, present, future, moving left to right, they expect the right hand of the presenter to signify the past, and the left hand to signify the future but he uses his own personal timeline in contrast to what the audience expects. Well, I think search today, compared to what it can be, is absolutely terrible. Compared to what it was, say, uh, two or three years ago, it's, it's fantastic. And while the celebrity status of Bill Gates and Charlie Rose will have us concentrating more on what they say rather than on how they say it, we can still learn a lot from the actions they use to deliver their content.